Hello everybody, this is the Planet Earth here. I wanted to show you uh, the max stream right now that I've ever seen Netflix is uh, 4,000 kilobits per second. K kilobits per second, not kilobytes per second or megabytes. Okay, so 4,024 is 4 megabits. Okay, so 4,000 kilobits per second. Okay, is 4 megabits per second. That's what ISPs use. So if you got like a 2 meg connection, 4 meg connection, 6 megs. If they say 6 megabytes, that's not correct. This is megabytes. Okay? Megabytes. Everybody gets confused for megabits and megabytes. ISPs always go by megabits. Okay? So at, if you were to download at point, uh, 4, 4 megabits per second, max out the connection on Netflix which the highest I've ever seen is uh, 3700 or 3800 you will be streaming at 4 megabits per second which is about 0.5 megabytes per second and 0.00424 gigabits per second okay 5 to the e to the dash terabytes per second in other words what I'm saying here is you will be streaming at kilobytes per second is a 503 kilobytes per second okay they go by kilobits Alright, so now we're going to go back to Netflix here. And they go by bitrate. So kilobits. They don't go by kilobytes. This is in bytes. This is in bits. So, if you have a 3,000, for this video, if you want to stream in perfect HD, you're going to need 3,000, which is 3 megabit internet connection, but a little bit faster. So you probably want to go with a three, 4 megabit internet connection. If you're going to stream HD Netflix at all, you're going to need 4 megabits per second max, minimum. But if you want to wait, you can force it to go to HD on a 1 or 2 megabit connection, assuming you let it buffer for about 30 to 40 minutes. So if you let it buffer, you can push Control alt shift s Click Manual Selection. Click as high as you want. If you want to go with 3,000, you have a 1.5. You're going to wait about 30 minutes before you can view the actual video. Let it buffer. It will take a long time. After you click apply, cut close, um, and wait for the video to load. It could take forever. I mean, literally, it could take forever. So, remember that the max that Netflix right now is streaming at is 37 to 38 to 4,000 kilobits per second. So, you want a 4 meg connection or better to stream Netflix nature. A lot of people... Say I can't get HD on the on a 10 meg connection. Well, that's because either your computer's too slow, your graphics card is too slow, or uh, your internet connection is too slow. Even though you have more than enough, you know people say that you need 50 meg connections to stream Netflix in HD. That's not true. Uh, 25 megabits. You don't need. You only need a technical 4 megabit connection. Uh. So you technically need at a 4,000 kilobits per second, which is 4 megabits per second, not megabytes. Every time I hate when uh, representatives from ISP say megabytes. It pisses me off because it's megabits. Now they said 5 megabytes, and it was an actual um, 40 to 50 meg connection. Well, then yes, I'd believe it. But if they say 50 megabits per second, it's megabits, not megabytes. Okay, so technically all you would need is a 4 meg connection with nobody else on the network but yourself. And you'll be able to stream Netflix in HD. But if you want to stream Netflix on a slow connection, such as like a, a wireless 4G connection, you can force it into HD. Control, Alt, Shift, S. Manual selection, put the highest quality, apply, and wait a long time for the video to buffer and load. It could take a long time. If it doesn't work for you, that means your connection is just too slow and you didn't wait for it to buffer. Okay. Um, thank you guys for watching. This has been the Planet Earth. I hope this video has been slightly helpful or helpful.